welcome back to Perks Recap. Back at it once again. We're hitting the Grateful Dead. This one is hard to handle. I obviously know the song. I think you probably do too. But let's see their version of it. This is from 1970, the Festival Express. I never, def definitely have never heard this version before. Definitely haven't heard the Grateful Dead do this before. But we do have some video for this as well. So let's just dive right in. Please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and let's get started. <laughs> so we don't miss anything uh this is just this is wonderful that's the best way i could say it hard to handle such a great great song otis redding back in the day um and then of course the black crows redid it in i think 1990 or so and that was a huge hit i think that was like a number one hit um the black crows version is very very good i have to say i really do like it i might even go so far as to say i think i might like it even more than the otis redding version 
but this one is very good as well. So, um, yeah, they're both really, really good. This is different, and I, I like seeing the Grateful Dead, early Grateful Dead 1970, but it's in color, and there is video of it. I actually haven't seen a whole lot of video of Pigpen, to be honest. I've done a lot of Grateful Dead with Pigpen there, but not, um, not really too many videos and definitely not too many color videos with him in it. Um, so that's uh, this is cool to see regardless. Anyway. Oh, and uh, I want to thank Sam for the donation and the suggestion for this one. Really, really good. Thanks. All right. Let's finish it up. Oh. Let's go back 10. Now let's finish it up. Such a good, good song, an all-time classic song, Otis Redding, and then uh, later on, The Black Crows. This was in between both. Very, very good version, very cool live version. But one of the coolest aspects is, like I said, is the the, the, uh, the video, Pigpen there. They all looking so young, uh, in color too, from 1970. So very, very cool video in general. But of course, the song sounded great, and they sounded great, and it's a great, great song. No complaints here, I know it, like I said. I'm going to see if there's any other versions that I can actually download on iTunes from The Grateful Dead. Um, I already have the Otis Redding version and I already have the Black Crows version downloaded. I will uh, try to find if there's a Grateful Dead version on iTunes and then I'll get grab it for sure. It, like I said, great, great song. Great, great guitar work, the whole thing. Uh, Pigpen, his vocals, unique for sure, but his, they fit the song perfectly. I like the little accents, the little high pitches he had in his, has in his voice, and they fit that song perfectly as well. So, once again, thank you, Sam, for the donation and the suggestion. If you'd like to be like Sam and donate information for Venmo and PayPal is in the description below. It's also at the end of this video, or hit the thanks button on YouTube, and if you donate, I'll react to anything you want me to. And if you want to come on the podcast, I just had Stephen Burroughs on. We talked about the Moody Blues for about, about 45 minutes. Check that out. Um, if you want to come on and talk about the Grateful Dead, I would love for somebody to come on. I want to talk a little bit about Aerosmith because that's the band I know the most, and I would love to talk about them. So if you want to come on and talk about Aerosmith, drop me a line. Either put it in the comments here or drop me a line at, at uh, perkspod at gmail.com or the email address for here, which is one recap channel at gmail.com. Either one, it'll get to me, and then we can organize a uh, chance for you to uh, get on the podcast and we can talk for a little while about that about whatever you want to really grateful dead aerosmith or any other band anything else you want to talk about that's going to do it once again thank you for joining me and until next time i will see you later